Hey guys, I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be solving three trigonometric integrals that you need to know. So stick around till the end. So question number one is the integral of sine to the power 4x times cos cube x dx. We can write cos square x as 1 minus sine square x. So substituting that in, we have sine to the 4x times 1 minus sine square x times cos x dx. Let's use some u substitution. Now differentiating both sides, we have du is equal to cos x dx and we can substitute that in nicely. So we have u to the power 4 times 1 minus u to the power 2 times du. That gives us the integral of u to the power 4 minus u to the power 6 times du. Let, we can break this down into two integrals and have the integral of u to the power 4 du minus the integral of u to the power 6 du which gives us our answer u to the power 5 upon 5 minus u to the power 7 upon 7 plus c. But now we have to substitute u back in as sine x. So we have sine to the power 5 x upon 5 minus sine to the power 7 x upon 7 plus c and that is our answer for question number 1. So our second integral is the integral of 1 upon 1 plus cot x dx. We can write cot x as cos x upon sin x. So now substituting that in, we have sin x upon sin x plus cos x dx. We can multiply the numerator and denominator by sin x minus cos x. In the denominator, we have sine square x minus cos square x. So now we have minus 1 times the integral of sine square x minus sine x cos x upon cos 2x. If you notice, sine square x minus cos square x is minus cos 2x. And sine x cos x is the same as half times sine 2x. So we have the integral of minus sine square x upon cos 2x plus half times the integral of sine 2x upon cos 2x dx. We can write sine square x as 1 minus cos 2x upon 2. So we have minus half times the integral of 1 minus cos 2x upon cos 2x plus half times the integral of tan 2x dx which gives us minus half times the integral of sec 2x dx plus half times the integral of 1 dx plus half times the integral of tan 2x dx and we have our answer minus 1 by 4 times the natural log of sec 2x plus tan 2x plus half times x plus 1 by 4 times the natural log of cos x plus c. Um, it has to be minus, I'm sorry for that. And that is the answer to the second integral. So now we have the third integral which is of cos to the power 4 2x dx. We can write cos square 2x as cos 4x plus 1 upon 2. So we have the integral of 
cos 4x plus 1 upon 2 whole square dx. Now opening the square we have 1 by 4 times the integral of cos square 4x plus 2 cos 4x plus 1 dx. So now we can write cos square 4x as cos 8x plus 1 upon 2. So now we have the integral of 1 by 4 times cos 8x plus 1 upon 2 dx plus 1 by plus half times the integral of cos 4x dx plus 1 by 4 times the integral of dx. So now we have 1 by 8 times 1 by 8 sin 8x plus 1 by 8x plus 1 by 8 sin 4x plus 1 by 4x plus c. So now simplifying we get 1 by 64 times sin 8x plus 1 8 sin 4x plus 3 upon 8x plus c and that is our answer to the final integral. Hey guys, if you've made it till here, you're a legend. Please click here and subscribe for more content and keep watching.